Hello and welcome back to Outer Worlds. So, we're gonna try to find more books for the guy that really needs some help with engineering. Because, uh, yeah, we're heading that way anyway. And it should be pretty easy. Hmm. Uh oh. Bandits. That means we're gonna take cover. I'm going. Where you got shot from? Uh oh. I'm going. Need some heels. Sure. Go to the tree. Well, this wasn't the best strategy. Take these guys out. She was, uh, maybe, yeah, she was, uh, I'm on my way. Not shooting for most of the fight. I'm just gonna find better locations. The thing is, like, if I tell her to stand behind a tree, uh, she's not gonna move around, like, just take cover like I would. She's gonna, like, like, standing over here and get shot all the time. So, not the best. But these. Uh, might be better and would uh, give her some cover against the enemies who don't really have the best aim. Primal Nest discovered. And uh, nothing really sent me there. Which could be a bad news. I mean that it's just too too difficult for me. Maybe we should head down. Check it out a little bit. If it's too hard, we run away. Oh, tactical shotgun. Okay. I don't mind if I do. Looks good. I mean, it's level 8. Oh, it also uses light ammo? That's crazy. Well, this thing had like decent range. At least like serviceable range. Then I would love it. But even like this, it should be fine. God damn it. Oh, that's garbage. I really need some. Okay, eat the bread. Okay, can we list these by weight? So this is. That's the heaviest? Yeah, that's the heaviest. These are the heaviest. Pretty heavy. Can I just eat all of these and get fat? Uh oh. Here they come! Can't get past that armor! Need to retreat. Going. Cool back in, but very carefully. Gotcha. <gasps> They're like, yeah, we chased them away. Good job, mate. So sure. like, oh. Here they come. Wow. Oh. 
Why have guns when you can't have logs? Barbade, you gotta run away. Very questionable. Do they have like max HP now? I do have a feeling that if we kill them, uh, we're gonna get their good stuff. Um, how do I trigger this? Okay, I, apparently I have it on the quick bar, but I can't trigger it. How do I trigger it? Controls? E binds? So how do we trigger the second thingy? Weapons, whatever. Hmm. I guess you don't. What? Radio menu? How do you do it? No, that's weapon radio. Last weapon. Weapon. No, there's just nothing. I'm not sure how you would do it. What's the point? Okay. It's a little tricky. Heading back. These are a little wounded. If you can take out one, that would be quite huge. I'm going. All right. I I'm trying not to use my uh, assault rifle that much. It's not very ammo conservative. Pick up all reliable. I am well. He died with it. How reliable it can be. It's a heavy weapon that deals a crap ton of damage. Parvati, that's yours. Look at this. 400. If you have that weapon, never use melee. Like, what's this? That's crazy. Okay. I just somehow um, maybe sell that breakdown. I don't know. Maybe we that. I need to make some space. I can eat some bananas. Pretty. Seems like all of these are pretty heavy. But I can't just eat everything. It doesn't work. Those don't weigh anything. The junk kind of weight weighs some stuff. So Yeah. These these worth something. Not a crazy amount, but worth something at least. Impact hammer, uh, no. What about the assault rifle? This is a uh, what like a uh, twelve time its weight. <laughs> I feel like a total scrub compared to you. You wear power armor, and you use a four hundred thirty DPS weapon. Compared to that, I'm a joke. But it's okay. It's team effort. Alright. Let's head out and... Uh, 
go where I wanted to go in the first place. Community center. That I already explored and I thought we kind of checked everything out, but apparently not. Got him off. Wow. Okay. All dead. Well done. Not enough loot. If I pick that up, I need to destroy it right away. Having some strength would be nice. Maybe I would just go for the plus extra carry weight. For, for convenience, honestly. Also, maybe not only for convenience. It would allow me to carry around a lot of uh, uh, problem solving items. Plus, well, at the very least, the heavy armor. And a lot of drugs. A lot of drugs. Old drugs! I understand. Finally, I understand the, the weightlifters. I got to the point in my life when I understand them. You just get so strong, so you can carry all the drugs. It makes sense. I never realized this. Come with me. We got super strong compared to, uh, compared to the time we were here. It's engineering volume one. Now the question is Find the three volumes and the third volume is as I don't know. Is lost. We don't we don't know where it is. But we got two, so Return to Grace. We have to return to Grace. And also, we got uh, a bounty. I still got one more guy that we gotta take out. The problem is, I don't really want to go in a state in this state. Uh, to the geothermal plant because I just cannot pick up a damn thing. So we might just head toward Grace, I think. And uh, just return the quest. Yeah, enemies never respawn, which is just great. I like that. Okay, the geothermal plant, it's huge. And apparently there's not much else we can do in this area. Maybe we can go there. I can also check that out, but that's close to the ship. Where am I going? Oh, I, I kind of went off track. And I started going toward the bandits. I guess we take him out now. But we also gotta be careful because... Let's end this quick. I didn't say... What? Nice one. Oh, fuck up. Wow. Great work. Yeah. Thanks for making me feel better. What are we dealing with here? Marauder Goon. Even if I kill these guys, I can't take their stuff. Maybe start with these bandits. Oh, 
He's not he's not sure I'm here. Are you sure about Go sure. behind that rock. Seems like a good place. Go All behind right. the rock. Yeah, we certainly did. <laughs> uh, maybe a heal? I think that's uh, justified. Let's take their tails. Do they have anything? Replayed. A little bit more strength would be nice. It's pretty likely that I just pick up a five, a 50 extra carry weight just for convenience. Oh, look at that. We got a cave here. Oh, nice. Blood on stick. This is terrible. I pick up one blade of grass and it's... Oh my god, you can't carry anymore. I can add it to junk. No, no, no. Let's eat some of these. No, no that's just crazy. Let's break these down. Is this worth something? No, this is worth nothing. Blood on stack. It's very special, but it's completely useless. So I guess we're gonna break it down. I don't wanna waste all my food. Oh, actually, I'm being dumb, right? It's possible to break down stuff when you're picking it up, but I'm never doing that. Can we sleep here? No. Nice. Tug kit. Melee weapon skills and defense skills. Uh, armor mod. Mr. Power. Okay, makes melee deal plasma damage. Some good stuff. And now I got all the bandits, right? All the bandits. We can also go over there. Should I attack these bandits as well? They are close. We got reload. I don't like this choke point. It's only good if we use the choke point, not they. Heading back. To run away. No problem. I'll head over. Sure. Seems like a like a good place to hide. Sure. On my way. You can, you can be there. Wait, what? Bandits! What the hell?
Oh my god, what the hell was that? I got hit for like 5 billion. God, he's chasing me out of cover. Run away with me! I need better armor too, Parvati. I'm on it. Open fire. I'm waiting for you to open fire. Okay, fire. That's done done. Oh my god, she almost died. That gun dealt a lot of damage. This is crazy. And with th this is with all the health buffs that I went for. She has a 30% increased health. And... Uh, I also, I'm also giving her extra health. And this goon just doesn't even drop his weapon. What the hell you were using? It was crazy. Oh. Break down. Break down the minor gear. Yeah, I'm, I'm really struggling for heavy ammo. You coming? Coming. Okay, maybe I should just take this high ground and use it to look around, if we can. No, I can't. Okay. Did this camp empty? I'm a little tempted to just shoot. And see if someone shows up. Armor parts. What is this place though? Old settlement that was taken over by marauders. Slice bread. Yeah. We have to go back, sell a lot of stuff, and also get water. Partially the reason I didn't get water is because I just I just have so much utility that I never use. I really should. But I'm not sure how. Is there a way to switch between utilities? Okay, I kind of fucked up one heal, but... I don't know, how do I switch between utilities? I, I tried, I, I went for the long press. <sighs> Game. Next. Okay. No idea. So, I can open up the weapon radio menu. That obviously no one uses. It's just crazy. Wait. Yeah. We can still run. Not a problem. Can't get in there. Oh man. So I guess that was it. Just some bandits in the corner. No problem. We need to... Maybe... Head back. To the ship. 
we can head back to the ship sleep a little bit not not a lot just a little bit and uh, after that after we woke up we just we can just head to, head to town and uh, whatever welcome aboard I thought getting access to my cabin is gonna be maybe easier okay let's tinker maybe so we got this old reliable weapon and uh, is there a way to upgrade this oh that's that's tinker modify modify the old reliable I can't I can't modify it what if I had it in my inventory can I modify it then tech shotgun seems maybe interesting to modify I can add in max size. That's not very good. Can also make it shock damage. Maybe makes it better against robots. Increases the crit damage by 25%. What else we can do? Increases the damage per minute by a tiny amount. And the rounds per minute by a tiny amount, the magazine size by a tiny amount. So, not super interesting. Crit damage. Question is, what is the base crit chance of that weapon? Okay. Yeah, I want to install some upgrades for my armor. Plasma armor rating. Only plasma damage. Physical damage. Uh, melee skills, defense skills, attack skills, range of weapon skills. Now that would be okay for me. How do we do that? Or just enhance it? I don't know. Let's go with range weapon. I cannot be recovered after installation. Good question. Do we still go for it? It seems like a good armor, but maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe we can find something better. I definitely want to sleep a little bit. Uh, six hours is the, is the minimum. I think that's going to be enough. Let's go. Burvati, I really hope you're ready to head out. Maybe we're also gonna check out uh, this area that undoubtedly was something that was put here so the curious players come here and possibly even find something rewarding. On my way. Oh, you could have found an well, we could have found an assault rifle. Get ready. Oh shit. Maybe curious and pretty dead. Can we slam bunk that? During your adventure, things may happen to your character that can trigger a flaw offer. Taking the flaw is optional, but doing so provides you with a perk. The choice is yours. After repeatedly getting beat up by primals, you no longer function well when they attack you or your companions. So when I... Wait. Does this mean that when I fight them, I have these penalties? But only then? Other than that, I'm I, I just have an extra perk point. 
Because I, I can take that. Let, let's do it. And maybe we're gonna go for extra car extra carry capacity. Vendor prices. Um, that might be interesting. But that's me buying stuff from the vendor. So we don't care about the slow time that much. Um, don't care about that. Companion crit chance. Uh, that's pretty good. So I want that. Vendor prices. XP from companion kills. That happens quite a bit. Wait, I don't get XP from companion kills? I guess this is bonus XP maybe? If I don't get XP from companion kills then, yeah. I guess that's hurting my level quite a bit. Base armor rating. As as I level up and as, as I get stronger, this base armor rating seems weaker and weaker. But carry capacity would be very convenient. I think I'm gonna pick it up. And I just hope that this penalty that we picked up is just uh, only applies to us when we fight primals, or it's just gonna be crazy. Coming. I see! The game is just like, I see you suck fighting against primals! Would you like to suck more? Sure, why not? Uh, where do I see my penalties? Character, details... Details? I'm super thirsty. Summary... Clear. Oh, wait. there it is. It's uh, dexterity, perception, and temperament. But my temperament is average, so that means it only active when I'm getting attacked by primals. I'm just kind of hoping that the game is no ab not about fighting primals. That is a pretty bad choice. Sprat. This doesn't seem like uh, a fun lobby area. At least if you came here as a lobby, uh, you would be sent back pretty quickly. Oh, my armor is getting beat up. Another assault rifle. More assault rifles. So I assume, I assume this was just a way to get access to assault rifles easier. But the problem with the assault rifles is that I don't have bullets for them. best gun I got right now is the shotty. Uh, yeah. Let's go to town. Oh crap. 
I guess right they're there. not alright. Oh, light pistol. I should have uh, scrapped that. To scrap it. Oh. What is this? We can go down toward the shore. But, uh, seems like a commonly used path, maybe? Unclear. Incoming. Oh, fuck! Kill it! I believe in you! Shovel. Can I use the shovel to dig out the grave? Maybe. Trouble? Grave? Can we punch the grave? That'll nope, that doesn't work. For me. Oh, my sniper rifle is in a bad condition. <sighs> Let's go to town. Six bullets out of 666. Where's the bloody entrance? Oh, I guess this is gonna work. We're near the, the spaceport. I need to trade. Need to buy some good stuff. At least we need to buy some water. <laughs> Damn, I should... Wait! One thing I should just uh, check out is how... Uh, much water weighs because if it's not as significant, like then I'll I guess I use I'll take a little bit more with me. Hey, bartender, uh, give me some water. Oh, baseball bat. I don't want. I don't want that. Plague got you feeling woozy? Get yourself boozy with Spacer's Choice. Very enthusiastic. I love it. Uh, give me some right drinks. Up. Oh, 10% discount, and the way it is, is the same for every single one, and they seem to have very similar effects. I'm not sure if the energy brew counts. So these are identical, right? Totally identical. But also she's not selling a lot. So we buy all this and that, and I'm not sure if the energy brew counts. We're just gonna go with all the water. And also sell all the junk. Do you care about my guns? So, she's willing to pay... Wait, what? 39 for this? It's not even worth that much. Alright. Uh, we just want to destroy that. Light. Pistol. Tig rifle. Total garbage. Oh, sure, why not? So, all these weigh half a kilogram. But these don't weigh a damn thing. And all, we already sell, sold all the junk. Uh, let's just see what we got. 
yeah, this needs to be destroyed. I don't know about the hunting rifle. Frankly, it's not good. It just doesn't deal enough damage. Very low DPS. I'll just destroy it. I can destroy the pistol. And uh, let's just replace the assault rifle and sell the. the we'll get you bomb. mostly. Coming right up. I'm not sure if she cares for the broken one that much. And she's fine with it. She's totally fine with it. Uh, this would be a nice thing to repair. Okay. Uh, first of all, we probably should just drink a little bit. That a little bit hurt the prices, I, I suspect. Uh, we can just keep drinking water. And we are maxed. Quite crazy, we had to spend 150 spacer's choice. The credits. Brand of choice for spacers on a budget. Oh, come on, zip it, Julius. I'm just here for Use the to my ears. stuff. So that's all his gear. But his armors are complete garbage. His weapons are kind of complete garbage. Light assault rifle, long guns, and it's a heavy bullet based. Not good. Long guns, light bullet based, sawed off shotgun. I got a better one than that. So light ammo is pretty cheap. Heavy ammo is basically three times as much. And energy cell even more expensive. He's not selling good stuff. I might buy a little bit of Adreno. Uh buy like five. This is not heavy, so we can just buy a lot of Adreno and uh not feel bad about it. Yeah, that those are way too expensive for what they offer. I'm a little tempted to just sell a bunch of them. Plasma armor rating. Physical armor rating. Crit damage by a little bit. Okay, Mr. Ouch. Max size. Tech skills on the armor. Maybe we don't want that. Melee weapon skills, defense skills. Um, I don't have any companion that really... Well, I only have one. And, uh... I don't know, armor. Probably not. I don't want her to run around with melee. She has an amazing weapon. That's very cheap. Okay, whatever. So, I did my best. And now we have a pretty respectable like 120 or so free slots to fill up with rewards. Whatever. And we can turn in the fingers. Wish we had some better. I've never actually Guess what? Something to report? Oh yeah. Guess what? Old bandits dead. We pay by the finger. What do you have for me? I got fingers. Gil Antrim. Real name, Guillaume. Duly processed by a freelancer on behalf of Spacer's Choice. I remember him. I was just a kid last I saw him. Shame. I'll just need your signature here, 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 and here. Got any more fingers for me? Yep. Mabel Burgess, age 37, right or left-handed? Let's just say, no longer applicable. I remember Doc Burgess, conducted my physical every fiscal quarter. 
Guess she couldn't keep her hands off her patient's medicine. Still one outstanding bounty. If you've got a finger, I've got the paperwork. I Here we it. are. Birdie Cotton. I should have returned Cause these of death. just to increase the reputation. Let's just say overwhelming physical trauma. Bert was the local preacher before Max took over. Always was quick to remind us that we all get what we deserve in the end. Well, that's all three. I must remember to requisition some more fingerprint ink. Here's all the compensation you've earned, plus a bonus. What's this, junior deputy constable? What? You've done such a bang-up job hunting down our former workers that I thought it only proper to deputize you. Congratulations. Really? How did so many of your people end up marauders? Let me stop you there. It is official Spacer's Choice policy that all marauders, regardless of prior affiliation to the Spacer's Choice brand, no longer qualify as our people. Right. It doesn't really answer my question. Marauders are folk who lost the will to keep working, wandered out into the wilds and gave into their baser instincts. Not everyone's cut out to work in Edgewater. Some turn deserter, some turn marauder. None of them get my sympathy. Right. Yeah, I heard of one of your workers shot himself, Eugene, I think. Uh-huh. I recall young Eugene. Good kid. Nice smile. Fussy about his health, though. Took a little too much Adrena time. That'll do a number on your brain matter. Says so right on the warning label. Violent psychosis is a well-documented and legally accounted for side effect of Adrena time. I guess that's it for now. I've been feeling pretty low. Maybe I should just check my reputation. Spacer's choice friendly. That's it. I don't know about these factions. They kind of like me. Deserters, not as much. Vendor prices are reduced by 15%. Would you look at that? What else? So, we can check the journal. We have the die robot uh, that uh, takes us to the geothermal. This takes us to the geothermal. This... We don't have the third volume for this. We can return to Grace. And we can also re retrieve some journal. Please, Dave. Which is over here. Not too far away. Please. But it might I'm be tricky to get. What is. Why do I have a shovel? Screw this. We are throwing away the shovel. Let's head out. Oh, actually, before we do that, this is where the match. Maybe do a little bit of workbench magic. Attack shotgun. I don't think that's super important. You can just put max size on that. How do do? How do we do this? Okay, fine. So, we can load more bullets in it. What would be a good mod for this weapon is that we replace what kind of uh, bullets we put in it. I can increase the damage of old reliable for a very minor, very, very minor bits. You can also increase the damage of the tech shotgun. Very, very low price. Okay. Repairing the armor would be quite important. So, this is gonna cost me many armor parts, but it's worth it. Modify. One armor is already modified, I believe. Oh? No? They're not modified. 
I can install mod. Physical armor rating. Range weapon skills. Okay, let's, maybe let's do that. One of them is going to have the physical armor. And one of them is going to have the ranged weapon skills. And it's quite obvious who uses who. Uh, which one. Maybe it shouldn't be. I don't know. Do I even need ranged skills? Does she need to be more tanky? This seems happens. Fine. Which one I'm using now? Range weapon skills! A little better. Retrofitted heavy power armor. Oh man, it's making our hack worse. But we can always just remove it. I like sneaking. So it's mostly hurting sneaking because we can just remove it for hacking if we really well, want to. Science. But it still happens here. Okay, we can put in nine bullets. That's cool. Hey, you hear about Wilson? I could use another companion. <laughs> I can't do that. What what do you mean you can't do that? Let's go! On the monarch! Root Bellamy. Uh, yeah, just maybe try to go straight to the objective. Maybe not super straight, but as straight as we can. Telling her what to do, but she's the one who's uh, getting it done. Ooh, okay. Yep, be right over. No, oh, I'm concussed twice. To pick this. Nice. Plasma rifle. How much DPS the, the gun has? Seventy one. Oh, really? It's long guns, but it hits like a truck. Look at that. Seeming like shoots slowly. Probably shoots very slowly. But hits hard. Okay, we'll see. Uh don't really want to come this way. I will try it on the Primal Hunter. He took one down! 
What? Yeah, but the charge attack actually cost us 5 ammo. So, not super impressive. Incoming. Oh, shit! I think I need to go down. Yeah, we're we're just fine right now. I'll just do the looting and you'll do the killing. So where next? A journal. Return to Vicar. You found the journal of Amba Konu. Return to Vicar just to get rewarded. I can also return to Grace. I guess I could do a lot of zipping around if I, if I want. Well, fast travel could really speed it up, but we can't do that right now. We just have to walk around. jump out or this is where my story ends no climb out here okay i just talked to biker i wouldn't mind going up to level six before we uh hit the geothermal i just want to play it a little safe because Look at this. I, I was taking it a low slow, and we went from uh, me basically considering to lower the difficulty and struggling like a lot to Parvati becoming immortal uh, and killing everything. And even light is getting uh, a little stronger. Hey, I got your, your fancy book. Any progress on that matter we discussed? Oh yeah, I got it. I got, I got the book. Wonderful. This is fantastic. Well worth all the sacrifices I... Wait. What the fuck is this? Is this... French? I can't fucking read French. It's a law-forsaken joke is what it is. French! Ha! I was so high and mighty, preaching to the yokels about following the plan, while fighting it at every turn. You didn't want that book to keep others from reading it, you just wanted it for yourself. Well, uh, yes. But I assure you, it was not for personal gain, only for the greater good. I've spent my life searching for the keys to unlocking the secrets of the universal equation that underlies the plan. I had hoped this book held some of those answers. I became so desperate, I even got myself assigned to this plague-ridden backwater to find the damn thing. All the time and suffering I've spent. Wasted. Can you just find the translator? At least you still have your mission work here to give your life a meaningful purpose. Why do you think the book held the secrets you were looking for? Bokonu, the author, had some interesting theories about man's perception of reality that I thought could be applied to our attempts to decipher the plan. Unfortunately, he was also one of the founders of the Philosophist School of Thought, so the book is banned in this colony. Philosophism's a false religion that stands in contradiction to almost everything we know to be true. They believe all is chaos, in stark contrast to OSI's belief in the plan. But most of the philosophist perversion of Bokonu's thoughts came more than a century after his death. 
A biker searching for a banned book sets a bad example, doesn't it? The story of my life. Most lay people are not aware of this, but we've not discovered any new insights into the plan for a long, long time. I had an idea that we should welcome the truth, no matter where we found it. I had the worst idea to share my thoughts with a superior. And that's how I ended up assigned prison duty, where I was fool enough to let an inmate bend my ear with stories of an original Bokonu journal. But that's neither here nor there. What I need to do now is to find a translator, obviously. But to do that, I'll first need to secure transport. You have a ship. Perhaps I could make myself of use to your crew. Whoa, really? Could be a beneficial arrangement. You need the ride of our out of town. I wouldn't mind the ship hand. What's in it for me, though? Free spiritual counseling, someone bullshit. to watch your back. Not to mention a grown up in the party. Yeah, you... I'm 28. Exactly. I'm pretty <laughs> handy with a toss ball stick, or any blunt instrument, really. I'm also a passable gun hand if it comes to that. I can usually talk my way out of conflict, though. Oh, I'm fairly competent at hacking computers as well. What? Very unusual past, uh, Vicar Max. I didn't expect this character to be a companion. Uh, sounds good, let's go. That's all part of your Vicar training? Well. Understanding computers is, though I admit I took it further than most. And I was quite the 32nd back during my penitentiary term. <laughs> Left many an opponent bleeding in the prison yard. Right. Are you even a vicar? Because you aren't sounding very vicarly right now. Of course. I'm a vicar who is dedicated to his calling. More dedicated than any other you'll find in this colony. I joined the OSI to help decipher the grand plan. But instead, I ended up the vicar in a prison due to ignorance and politics. Then I came here. Satisfied? Yeah. <laughs> well, you're welcome on board. Sounds good, let's go. Fantastic. Let me get my things in order and I'll catch up with you. Edgewater's gonna miss you. Folk here always had good things to say about their vicar. Thank you, Ms. Holcomb. I'll be glad for the change of scenery, and to leave this place behind. I shall see you on the ship, Captain, whenever you're ready to leave Emerald Vale. I really hope Parvati is gonna come with me as well. I'm kind of buttering her up a little bit. I'm still planning to uh, do drugs and talk about her dad. So, wait, are you just not... I'll meet you on the ship when you're ready to depart from Emerald Vale. All right. Captain. So, he's not a companion just yet. I can level up now. Let's do it. Perks. Good question. So, base armor rating, I don't value it a lot. Tough call. Companion crit chance. Vendor prices, so we can buy stuff for cheaper. That seems like a good deal in this game where everything is very, very pricey. I think we might go for that. So we go for vendor prices and uh, companion crit chance, I think. Science weapon damage. Vendor buying price, so we can get more money. These tier 2 skills are a little situational. Forty kilogram carrying capacity bonus from companions. Plus 10 dialogue skills. Oh, only no companions. Well, we're obviously not getting that. I don't know. I, I think money is going to be tight. And the negotiator could help. Maybe do that. Obviously, we're going to need negotiator. 
and snake oil th salesman. I don't think we need the extra damage now. Let's, let's go with that. Apply. And uh, skills. Good bloody question. What skills we're gonna go for? Tinkering cost 50%. That's increases uh, the effect of my weapons. I can just tinker with them. Engineering. Uh, repair weapons and armor in the inventory. Uh, that seems pretty good too. I don't really care about these drug mixing slots. It seems a little odd. Uh, we have 44 long guns, which is enough. I can... Long guns crit damage plus 50%. Big split damage. I don't really care for that. I think we are just fine. Persuade... Persuade is uh, good enough again. Scramble duration. I think I need to bring up my science skills. So tinkering cost goes down. Corrosion damage. I don't know. I think we need to bring up the science skills. Maybe the sneaking skills like that. Unlocks access to restricted items in vending machines. So, we have access to even better stuff from vending machines. Oh, yeah, I need to get good at hacking and lockpicking. Because we just cannot open containers right now. I also need to get better at engineering. Sneaking. I, I can do sneak attacks. Pickpocket steal from humans. Find 25% bits in containers. Okay. That's a little unclear what to go for. Maybe, maybe go for stealth. So this way, we have 40 hack, and we probably want to push it up by 4, just to get access to lockpick 20 and sneak 20. So we're just kind of going with a little bit of everything. Let's apply. Apply. Yes, I'm applying it. That's it. Parvati and Vico. Oh, Vicar. Vicar Max. Wow. What a team. But Vicar is not going to help me right now. We have to do this ourselves. And I'm really hoping you're coming with me. Yeah. We have to talk to Grace. We have to find another book that we have no idea where it is. Uh, we got to find the logic module. And we have only one place to go. It's the bloody geothermal plant. And I'm ready. We have everything. This is what we prepared for. How much HP we have? Oh, that's kind of curious. Would be nice to know. Details. Yeah. 1,125. And she has... Um, 1,060. Pretty good. But she's also tankier. So, that's good. Saltuna Factory. Veil, we're leaving and trying to. Maybe I'm wrong about that uh, geothermal, but I was mainly I was not. Yeah, I, I was I was definitely expecting it. I'm definitely expecting it to be a difficult fight. But on top of that, I'm expecting it to be a difficult choice. Like spacer's choice, guys really love me, and we got the the garden. Like now I have the choice, choose between two. Uh, settlements in a way Anyway guys, uh, that's it for now. Uh, thanks for watching and see you next time